Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to a new Minecraft Dungeons Hardcore Survival episode. In this season, I will try to beat Minecraft Dungeons starting at the default difficulty at level 1 all the way to Apocalypse level 7 plus 20. And this all without dying one single time, so yes, this is gonna be a hell of a challenge. We also have some pretty spicy game rules that will make things even more difficult. Rule number 1, I can only play every level one single time per difficulty, so that means if I wasn't able to find the secret level in there that is just too bad. That I have to move on. Rule number two, no level resets are allowed. So if I get a very bad map generation or don't find any secrets on the map, too bad once again, I am not allowed to reset it. Rule number three, I always have to play on the maximum difficulty. So I always have to put the slider all the way to the right, even if this makes it almost impossible. Rule number four, I am not allowed to die because I only have one life to complete this entire playthrough all the way from default to apocalypse level 7 plus 20. And then last but not least we have rule number five, in my opinion the most epic one because you guys get to choose this every single episode. Which means you can just leave your original game rules in the comments down below and the most voted, the most liked game rule will be in the next episode. Of course make sure that it is fun, original and most of all doable because if it's not I will just pick another game rule. And yes guys I am definitely interested in having other people involved in this hardcore survival series. So if you have an original game rule that will allow other people to join me just leave it in the comments down below. Already a big thanks to every single one of you for sharing your ideas. So that's it for all the hardcore rules for season 2 guys. Let's get right to the episode. Guys can I just start this episode by saying why do you hate me so much? Really, why do you guys hate me so much? I mean, we are a new series and it seems like you guys are trying to bully me on my very own hardcore survival series with these insane game rules that just keep coming up in the comment section and also uh, punishment because yes, yes, you're right. Last episode, I failed to find one secret, one single chest in the entire level and right now I am going to be punished. So um, first off, Lord Force came up with a punishment. He said, you have to salvage the next unique you find. But of course, it was Patrick's game rule last episode, and he said I had to find every single one of them, and he also had the most votes on his comment, and he said, punishment, you have to salvage every item you pick up in the next level. Is that too harsh? He asked as well. Is that ironic, or do I have to be real with this? I mean, this is not nice. This is absolutely not nice. So right now you would say, oh, we have a new episode, we have some new possibilities, new opportunities, but then people come up with these game rules, guys. Seriously, first off, Montgomery Cat, fifth game rule, you can only roll to move. Seriously, the levels that I can currently play are very long, so why would I do this with only rolling? It's gonna take like an hour, oh my god, but thank god we had also Spying Pro, but this game rule is not anything better. I mean, it's even worse, actually. Soggy Camp, if a witch hits you with a potion, you can't attack for five seconds with a winky face. Seriously, that winky face. But um, yes, guys, we're going to take Spying Pro's game rule today. Um, if you think you have a very awesome game rule, just leave it in the comments down below. It will be very much appreciated because uh, that is what makes this Hardcore Survival series so original and epic, in my opinion. But we're going to have to think about not being able to wear any piece of gear that we currently find. So yes, we don't have any upgrades this entire episode, but we do have, look at this guys, we do have 1,402 emeralds. So I think I should visit the village merchant. And yes, I really don't like this guy with this amount of wares he has for sale, but um, I am going to do it anyways. So uh, we're gonna restock this bad guy for two, just two items. I know this is very bad, but um, I'm just gonna do it, man. So we found a power level 20 sword. I think that's actually an upgrade. Um, not really sure if I want to get rid of my hog brand right now, but um, I'm gonna do one more reroll. Just, just do it for a piece of armor or something like that. Sickles and daggers. Seriously, oh my god. We want to have something with a decent range. Well, let me just do one more roll. Okay, I am ruining my emeralds right here, I know. But at the same time, 
You never know. We might be able to find something really nice. This is my very, very last roll. Okay, we found a rapid crossbow of level 27. 27 is actually insanely good, but 24 to 61. And this guy has 17. So that's pretty bad, right? Oh my god, I think I just re-rolled all for no reason. 31 to 78 with dynamo, though. Guys, look at this. I'm actually gonna take this guy. My item for 160. That is going to be a nice upgrade from 17 to 22. It's just one power level increase, but it's nice. It's nice. We got dynamo on this bad guy. That is sweet. So uh, we're going to put this on level two. So maybe we will be able to take down some pretty crazy mobs with it. We're going to do a lot of uh, rolling, Montgomery Cat. Don't worry about that because <laughs> we have the dynamo enchantment. All right. So guys, are you ready for it? We're going to go for a new level. Okay. Let's go for this one. And every single level that we can currently play has a village merchant, which we can unlock. So that is really nice. Uh, we have the redstone mines. We have the soggy swamp, both with um, a boss. So yeah, that's going to be pretty exciting. And then the cacti canyon and pumpkin pastures, also with village merchants. But yes, I took spying pros game rule, so I have to go for the boss straight away. Oh boy, this is going to be a hell of a challenge because my gear is pretty bad right now. And oh my god, we're going to have to do it on default level 7 as well. Power level is 17. Recommended power level 33. Once again, it is doubled. So um, may the force be with me, guys. Seriously. Oh boy, this is going to be... Thug life, guys. Really have to salvage every single item I find. So this entire level, I won't be able to get my hands on a single upgrade for this hardcore series, seriously. So, um, we're already getting swarmed by many, many mobs. And oh boy, they hit like a truck, man. Oh, okay, I just used my potion bearer. Now I'm gonna mow them down one by one, really. Or not. <laughs> it's just wear off. So, uh, it's not gonna happen. Why so many of them? There we go. Look at that. Back at it again with the crits, y'all. Sweet. I do like the fishing pole, though. With the stunts, it's actually working out right here. Look at that. You can just stun lock the baby zombies. And the crits, man, they just keep going and going. I will just use their arrows, guys. Legolas, Legolas. Look at this, dodging them arrows at the same time. Oh, like a mouse. Wow, the baby zombies actually have more HP. You can't believe that, right? Okay, we are not allowed to take damage from the potions. Oh, five seconds, five seconds. Thank you, Spike Pro, thank you. So, um, yeah. I'm gonna have to be careful for those bad guys. But some of you are probably thinking, Legolas, Legolas, why are you always talking about Legolas when you start shooting your arrows? Guys, really, you probably think, oh, who is Legolas? What is Legolas? Why is Legolas? Lord of the Rings, please, guys, Lord of the Rings. It's probably the best series in the world. If you are a little bit younger, you probably have already seen uh, the Hobbit movies. Well, the Lord of the Rings was before that, and they were 10 times better. I get it. If you're a Lord of the Rings fan, just like me, you would probably like and even love The Hobbit. You can see it a million times, but uh, the regular Lord of the Rings, man. I grew up with that, with PlayStation 1 games of Lord of the Rings, man. Oh, that was so cool, really. We were able to play Gandalf. I really loved Gandalf. It was the most epic one. And then also uh, Aragorn. Actually, I look a little bit like Aragorn right now. Look at this. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. <laughs> That's pretty much how it goes. I should make a song about it, really. But um, yeah, it's uh, it's such an epic trilogy. If you haven't already checked it, make sure you do because it's it's the best of the best. It's way better than all the Marvel crap you can see these days. That was some true cinema, some true film quality. Every single day, I'm I'm checking Netflix and hoping for. Uh, Finally, a nice adventure movie to pop up once again, but it just doesn't happen, guys. So maybe we should make a petition about that. So I'm just going to shoot my enemies from afar. And oh, look at that, Chris, Ketter Chris Bear. That's nice. That's really nice that we just found a Scatter Crossbow. Oh, this guy. 
is gonna be a danger for me. There we go. So, let's check it out, man. Maybe it has some pretty cool enchantments. No. But um, we have to salvage it anyways, guys. Epic punishment. Thank you once again for that, Patrick. I have to salvage every single item. I'm just gonna remind myself about it because I don't want to make myself illusions of finding something nice and actually being able to wear it. This episode is gonna be terror, torment, and yes, it's gonna make me very sad. Just fall down, dude. Oh boy. He actually wanted to kill me right there. Sometimes I get, have the feeling like these big guys don't do anything and then you get the small guys and they hit like a truck, man. What's up with that with the slimes? They do drop a lot of stuff though, so that is cool. There we go, there we go. Not really sure why I keep stunning. Oh, five seconds rule. The five seconds rule. I'm not sure why I just keep stunning the big guys because you can tell that they don't do anything. They are nice to me. Ouch. Ouch. Whoa. He's actually right there. Didn't knew he was that close. There we go. You got what you deserve, bruh. Alright. On to the next objective. Find the bruise. We're almost there. I can smell the bruise, guys. Oh, I just killed this potion. Look at that. How epic is this, man? You can shoot the potions. I didn't knew that. Is this something? MLG? Okay, well, this time it didn't work, but... Well, and right now I just killed him. Anyways, did you just see that? I actually shot his potion. That was so cool. I just keep learning new things in Minecraft dungeons. Of course, not when you're speedrunning. You're just ruining the level in a couple seconds. Let's make sure this creeper dies. Because, of course, you won't want them to boom in your face, then it's a game over. <laughs> I am not sure why I just started speaking French, but really. Um, I can actually speak French, though. Oh! I have to wait five seconds now. Oh, what well, that was... Uh, <laughs> not five seconds. So let's take a hit as punishment. But, uh, yeah, let's just not make it a game rule, guys. We're not gonna talk French, alright? This guy, what the hell is he doing? I'm gonna put him out of his misery or not. <laughs> okay. We are not going to make it a fifth game rule, right, guys? That would be a shame. There we go. Oh man, strength potions, they are the dream. Look at that. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Look at my HP. Now it is a little bit dangerous. Oh, 18 power level glaive, guys. That is awesome. Probably a huge upgrade. Look at that. Two enchantments. Even smiting. But yes, we have to salvage it. Merci beaucoup. There you go, man. Get owned. Okay, I'm gonna summon my ghost man. I just want to have some backup right here. So we'll be able to mow down those enemies a little bit easier. Oh, he's gonna focus, of course, the guy that is stuck in the wall. Good job, dude. Really? Oh, 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 we've got an intruder right here. An intruder. Oh, big damage, big damage. Oh, he just died. That's great. When I need him the most! Oh, boy. That was scary. 
Why am I doing this? Ooh, and Shadow Bro. Damn, okay. <laughs> I'm not even close, man, really. Oh, no, 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 no. I was gonna stun him. What the hell is it with the... With the fishing pole, man. It is so buggy. Sometimes it goes towards your... Uh, your mouse cursor, sometimes it doesn't, sometimes it just flies to random directions. They have to fix this thing, man. Such broken coding right there. Alright, I have an idea for these slimes, guys. I have an idea. Because they take a lot of time to kill, right? This guy is super friendly, though. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Bad news, guys. I am in trouble right here. We're gonna do some kiting around here. Oh. Oh, boy. Okay. Friend, help me out. Help me out. Oh, he insta-killed. Insta that is not sweet. He's actually quite squishy. We've got another one. We've got another one. Ouch. Potion barrier. There we go. Wow, dude. Seriously. Okay, now it is time to take down those. Uh... No, 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 no. There we go. We're gonna deal with the slimes, guys. But first, I'm gonna blow up the Puipas. Wow. Such a feel. But ah, uh, it actually did kill them. That is cool. Okay, we do want to get our hands on some food, so we're gonna have to take down some of these guys. First, I'm gonna deal with Mr. Woodcutting. Uh oh. They can hit me hard, so let's be a little bit careful, guys. No looting, seriously. Not a single looting. Okay, that is nice. Some arrows. There we go. Okay, I just... What the hell is going on? I just pulled him into the map. So right now I'm not even allowed to take him down. That's fine, that's fine. We're gonna do some more uh, experimentation right here, guys. I have an idea. Look at this, look at this. Whoop! <laughs> oh, that is great fun, man. You can just destroy them with the environment. Whoop! Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, oh, no. Okay. Let's, let's try it again. Well, it didn't work. It didn't work, but it's it's okay. It's fun. It's fun. We get it. So, um, let's search for, like, a really strong mob or a couple of strong mobs like these. Well, that was an epic fail, but uh, at least I tried, right? Oh, get on, son! That is so much fun, man. Seriously. That is so much fun. Come on, come on, come. Come to me. Come to me. Oh boy. Ouch. He didn't spawn babies this time. Or well, actually he did. The big guy is stuck. That's so sad. Oh man, the crits, they just keep popping up. That is so nice. Oh man, that was... Nice. Oh, <gasps> evocation rope, guys. Evocation rope. What power level is this one? 21 with cowardice, deflect, potion bearer. Ah, I have to salvage it. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I have to salvage it. Oh, man. I'm enjoying my own misery right now. Really. It is miserable, guys. Every time when you find these upgrades, man, that was a thing with two enchantment points. Two enchantment slots. Why would you not use it on hardcore? We are almost on 1000 emeralds, so. So we're making some progress at least. Alright, find the cauldron. New objective. I 
I am not really sure what I have to think about the cave, guys. Because we might be able to find some uh, some really evil creatures right there. So, um, we do have two enchantment points. So maybe... Hmm, I can upgrade my potion bearer to seven seconds. That will definitely be interesting. Or I could go, for example, with Busy Bee or Poison Cloud or... I don't know, man. I'm actually gonna take the potion bearer. Seven seconds is super nice. This is usually the place where you get owned by another man. Okay. We're gonna play that game, right? Oh, just clicked out of my window. Ah, there it goes. It's goners. Enderman, are you home? Yes. They're always Enderman right here. I don't like it, man. Where is he? He's right there. Can we actually stun this guy? No, we cannot. Okay. Oh. Dude. Come on, we can take him down. Come on. Thank God I have a tank for this. <gasps> oh, okay. I survived. I survived. That's fine. He's going to backstab me for sure pretty soon. Him down, boys. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't want that. We don't want that. We just survived the Enderman. Come on, leave me alone. And we do have a little piglet somewhere. Oh, there he is. Okay. Come here. Piggy. Come here, boy. Oh, poor lad. Strength potion, evocation rope. Okay, that's nice. We just found two more upgrades, even one with the double cooldown reduction, one built in, one. Optional. <laughs> Man, hear me being salty right here with that punishment. I did get punished big time, guys. Come on. That's not fair. Next time, make sure you come up with something original or uh, something uh, creative. That's, that's exactly the same two times, actually. But, um, yeah. If you have an epic game rule, just leave it in the comments down below. And make sure to be nice to me, okay? Be nice to me. What's this? Is this a secret location? I have no idea. Bam! These guys are always so much fun to just knock them back with your arrows. I okay, guess we found everything right here. Or, well, we didn't find anything, but uh, we killed all the bobs, right? Got a big one right there. This one is definitely gonna drop me some loot. This one is definitely gonna drop me some loot. That's why I really like the slimes. See? 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 Shadow Brew, Swiftness Potion. Right now I'm like Invisible Superman. Da -dum, da -dum, da -dum. And here we are back again. All right. Soon we're going to have to fight the cauldron. I have no clue what my game is going to be because, oh boy, this guy is going to hit me like a truck with his fire. Actually, can we destroy this guy? environmentally, I don't think so. Just gonna have to outplay him with the arrows. That's fun as well. You can just knock him back all the time. That's like the easiest way to deal with him, guys. Oh! Oh, no, no, no. That didn't work out as I thought it would be. Well, you're gonna give me some loot, dude. There we go. Swiftness potion. Ultimate speed. Ah, we did kill a potion once again. Look at that. It's so cool. If you can shoot it away. That it was nice place, man. That was 
It's a nice place. Bam! Get owned, son. I'm not really sure if I want to go treasure hunting around these parts because... Hmm... Or actually, maybe I should. Oh no, I shouldn't because I have to salvage everything anyways. I don't want to find a unique and then have to salvage it. That would be such thug life. And we actually have a chance on doing so at the boss because he usually drops some uh, uniques, right? Okay, that is straight up evil, man. They shouldn't be allowed to do that. Okay, I think we found the end of the cave. I think we did. Oh, that is sweet. I was starting to get a little bit claustrophobic right here. Nice. There we go. Oh, what's that? What's that? Fast attack, um, quick and regeneration. Okay, <laughs> this is this is nice. Um, what the hell are we going to do against these guys? Seriously. Two seconds left. We can take them down range, but no, 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 no. They are regenerating, man. They are impossible for me to take down. I just have to run away from them. There is another one, seriously. Come on. Why does the game hate me so much? Why does the game hate me so much? I'm just gonna have to skip these mobs. I'm actually gonna lure the big slime towards me. So we're just gonna get all his friends gathered up right here together. And then we're gonna run away, guys, because this is mission impossible. See ya! Oh, whoa, 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 this is not happening. This is not happening. Okay, they're dealing damage to me. They're dealing damage to me. I cannot attack. I cannot attack. I'm just gonna skip all these guys, really. Now I'm gonna attack. Okay, he just hit me. That's not cool. We have a lot of mobs after us, so right now we have to start cleaning some because, oh, this is gonna be super bad for us if we... Okay, this is better. This is better. Now we have some place without mobs around us. We just skipped, like, many of them, but, um... I don't know, man. Sometimes you have to skip mobs, right? That was just plain impossible. Strength potion, here we go. Just gonna use my potion bear because, I don't know, man. I wanna take down some bad guys right here. I'm gonna save our uh, buddy with the souls. It's gonna be respawning pretty soon. TNT, baby. Oh, yes. We're gonna blow shit up. Look at that huge army right there. Uh-oh. This is a problem. No, they're everywhere. They're everywhere. I'm not sure if they're still there. Ah, the witch is a little bit stuck. I cannot hit her right now. Nice. Okay, we dealt with everything, right? We're doing so nice. <laughs> man, oh man. It's hardcore, man. It's seriously hardcore, this episode. Thank God we have a bow with some arrows. Otherwise, this would have been impossible. We don't even have healing, man. There we have some apples dropping. Two of them, actually. Sweet. 
Okay. Some supplies. We definitely have enough arrows for the boss, but um, still, those guardians of him are gonna deal tons and tons of damage. I'm actually gonna have to start stacking up my dynamo a little bit or something like that. Uh oh, we have some bigger guys coming up pretty soon. What the hell? He was able to see me. Does this guy have like uh, a visibility vision or something like that? There we go. I think I see a shed of light at the end of the tunnel. I think we do, guys. I'm gonna have to confirm with the map. We're gonna open it pretty soon. After this little fight. Oh, yes. I think this is what you guys probably also think what it is. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, boy. This is good news. This is really good news. We probably have the secret uh, level of this map. I think that's the entrance. Man. If we didn't have the looting, guys, this would have been almost impossible, really. Because this allows me to keep finding all those arrows. And they are, with the hunter's armor, they are buffed. So the bundles are, get like 10 extra arrows. Ouch. Ouch. That hit me really hard, man. Seriously. There we have it. Oh, sweet. Look at this. We have the secret temple. Actually. Well, I'm just gonna... Check out what we have right here. Oh, cool. I can hit his face. We hear the waterfalls. They make like a super realistic sound. Here it is. But they look like crap, really. <laughs> Epic, man. Epic. I still like the simplicity of Minecraft dungeons. I mean, it's way better than a regular Minecraft. It's like Minecraft on shaders. Um, what did we just do? We already opened it. Okay, that was super strange. We can just walk to this place. That is so weird, man. New location. Look at that. I thought you had to... Oh, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. Five seconds. Yes, yes, I promise. I promise. Normally you have to, like, clear the waves of mobs, right? And right now I can just instantly take the scroll. That is so weird. Oh, nice. Another upgrade. Well played. Bam, that was a huge crit to the face, yo. Bam. I think this is the last of them. Oh, no, 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 no. We've got some more right here. Okay, something opened. That is nice. That's positive. And what is it? Oh, nice. Now we can open it. That is so great, guys. <laughs> it literally does nothing. It didn't spawn a chest or anything like that. Sweet. So how many chests? We found zero of the four chests. Oh, that is fantastic. That's a true achievement, guys. Uh-oh, this is not good. Five seconds left. Four, three, two, one. Oh! Okay, let's summon this guy for some backup. He actually hits pretty hard, man. It's a cool, it's a cool pet. I should play with him more often, but then again, he can despawn, and you have to gather all those souls in order to summon it. 
which is pretty annoying in my opinion. But uh, he's a cool guy with a ribbon on his back. It's a true magician. And we just leveled up. Another enchantment point. Nice. I start to get a little bit afraid of the boss, actually. I really have no idea what I have to expect from that battle. It's already a pain to get through these. I'm just gonna... Oh, no, 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 I took the wrong way right here. This is a dead end. Great. Hey, don't punch me, dude. There we go, with the crits. Oh, it's so sweet, man. But the looting is not... Oh, wait a second. It, it is helping me out. I'm a little bit afraid of these guys, though. They hit me so hard. Guys, seriously, look at this HP. He simply doesn't want to die. Oh, that was scary. That was really scary. Got another chest right there. I'm a little bit afraid, guys. This is it. This really is it. We have 160 arrows. Will this be enough to take down the boss? Mm, I am not sure about it. So I'm gonna drink this potion for a second and let's check what we got. So we find an evocation rope of level 19. Uh, yeah, this is a pretty bad one, but look at this, guys. Oh my god. Power level 29 glaive with so much damage. If you compare it with this guy, 23 to 36, 63 to 93, that's like triple the damage, guys. With echo even, you can, oh, you can double hit. This is actually an enchantment that is pretty bad right now. Some of your attacks can be followed by another attack in rapid succession, but I think some time ago it actually did triple uh, attacks instead of double attacks. But then of course we could take looting on this one and then also the prospector. It would be really nice, but yes, thank you for the punishment. We're gonna salvage it. So um, yeah, it's time for the boss. I'm curious. I think I'm gonna play this safe, really, because, yeah, of course, we're playing hardcore, but um, we don't wanna mess things up right now. Okay. We can actually hit him quite hard with that. We're gonna stay in range. We're gonna stay in range, for sure. I'm just gonna stand right here. I think this is a sweet spot. Because then the slimes won't be able to hit you. But, of course, all the other mobs will be able to. Don't want to waste their arrows on all the other mobs. Oh, damn. So many, they just keep spawning, man. Okay, those arrows were super bad. All right, take him down. Take him down. There we go. <laughs> this fight is going to take a while, guys. Oh boy. Ouch. They hit me pretty hard, man. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. There's so many after me. Ouch. And they're all not dropping anything really, so this is really bad, guys. 
We have 129 arrows left. I'm not sure if this is going to be doable without arrows. Whoa, what the hell happened? I just froze right there. I was going to use my potion barrier. Get past these mobs. Just going to have to do a couple hits every now and then. Do a little circle, walk around this guy. Oh boy, look at my HP, man. Oh boy. This is bad news. This is really bad news. <sighs> 4 HP. Let's wait for a potion barrier to uh be ready once again. <laughs> man, oh man. This is this is seriously dangerous. If I only was able to pick up all those items, guys, and not salvage them, then this would be so much easier. But right now it's it's literally impossible. Just gonna walk around so I can get a clear shot on this guy. Okay, we've got a shadow brew, that's sweet. Oh boy! Oh man. I don't really like this. Gonna need another potion barrier. These guys, they are so tanky. What the hell? Won't be able to do much really against them. Might have to fast forward this because it's gonna take a while, guys. The thing is, these mobs also don't drop any loot. So it's not making it any easier. Strength potion would be awesome right now. I can't just really can't get a clear shot on this guy. Okay, that's some two hits. It's not much, but it's something. Okay, that's nice, that's nice. Just keep poking him a little bit. I'm gonna use my potion bear once again. Ouch. We're gonna have to run away right now. Okay, it's almost a one third of HP. <laughs> one third, guys! Can you believe this? Oh, that was a very weak arrow. Ouch! Okay, okay. Oh, potion, potion! Man, there are so many enemies. I'm gonna have to call in some help right here. This guy has to clear some mobs for me. I have to do it together. It's teamwork. Come on. There's so many of those small slimes. It's just impossible to hit the boss right now. They just keep popping up, really. Oh, boy. Nice. We did hit him a couple times right here. 40% HP. Man, 
man, it's so scary, really. Seventy three arrows left. Ouch! No, this is not the end. This is not the end. Come on. This is a survival round, guys. It's gonna take a while, but... This guy running after me all the time. I'm. This makes me mad, really. Just despawn or something. Okay, nice. 50%, 50%. Okay, that was an epic fail. Nice. 50%, guys. I think I just said that already, but... Uh, we're making some progress. Slow but steady. Slow but steady. Wow, <laughs> this is such a crazy level, man. Episode 3, and you said, oh, it's gonna be boring. Some of you guys said it's gonna be boring, but really, it's not boring. I'm sweating my ass off right here. It's super scary, actually. I'm getting chased 24-7. We have 50 arrows left. Without arrows, this is gonna be impossible because we don't have the power level for it. Ah, oh, we've just filled an arrow, guys. Oh, no, 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 We don't want to bring this guy too close. Oh, potion barrier. Okay, 30%, 33, I mean. We're getting there, guys. I found my way around. I found my way around. No mistakes, no mistakes. Okay, we're gonna have to do this slow and steady once again. Nice. It's another good hit, really. Ouch, okay. Right now, no hitting for a second. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, come on. <laughs> This is madness! This is madness! <sighs> My heart, man. I'm getting a heart attack right here. Okay. Okay, we just missed 30 arrows. The speed boost is so important, really. Okay, man, we just got hit a couple times. Now we're gonna have to wait for a potion bearer. Man! Alright, 20%, something like that. Of course, he's spawning slimes right in front of me every single time. They just keep popping up right in front of me. Come on, leave me. Leave me alone. Getting another dynamo stack right here. Uh oh. That was a little bit too tricky. This is too tricky. Come on. We're gonna have to do another round. Take the potion. Let's make this shot count, because we've got dynamo. Yes. Oh boy, my HP is super low once again. Come on, Fury, I'm just a couple more minutes. 
Just a couple more minutes. Oh boy. They are just everywhere, these mobs. Okay. Super low right now. I'm gonna take down this guy though. He doesn't deserve to live more seconds. Yes. It happened, guys. It happened. Oh my god. We took him down. Can you believe this? How long did this battle take? Seriously. I think I deserve a good game rule for the next episode. I mean, like, this is too thug life. I just got my hands on a unique. A level 25 unique, guys. Seriously. And... Ah, oh, man. I, <laughs> I have to relax for a second because my heart is... Going like crazy. So, um, I've got a power level 25 with swirling. Oh man, all the good stuff. I, I don't want to look at it. I don't even want to look at it. I'm just going to salvage it straight away. So, um, there we go. Um, it did rescue a villager as well. So that is nice. Whew, the gift wrapper. Oh man, this one is so useless really. But uh, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> we managed to survive this level. I don't want to know how long this took. Over... I don't know. I, I don't know. But uh, it would be nice to go back to the camp, do some relaxing, and maybe also buy some upgrades, because we weren't able to buy items the entire run. I mean, uh, use items. 613 arrows hit, 91% damage taken, 4k, 25% chest open. That's sad, the 25%, but... I didn't see any of them popping up. I mean, what was going on right there? Oh, that is nice. A 31 totem of regeneration. We were definitely struggling with our uh, HP many times. We were only able to use the potions. So um, it would be very nice to have an extra healing. And uh, since we're not using the boots many times, um, I think this will be very awesome. Look at that power level 19. And uh, the village merchant does sell me some nice stuff. For example, a 25 hunter's armor with some cooldown reduction. Okay. 25 compared to... Yeah, this is definitely a buy for me. Great. And we could also... Yeah, I'm gonna buy this one. I'm also gonna do a restock. You never know, guys. Might be something even better. This is uh, 48 to 73. Ah, yes. We're, <laughs> we're gonna do that, man. Seriously. 23, 23, 23, 22. Uh, let's do one more restock, I guess. You never know. 26. Wow. Um... This one does have some nice things, but I don't know, man. Now, this one doesn't have any heals. It's bad. We do have the stunning, though. 50% chance to trigger. Rampaging is also really awesome. Weakening is even better, actually. Weakening plus looting. I think I'm going to go for that combo, really. Uh, yes, we're going to do this. Uh, Boots of Swiftness, power level 21. We're not going to take those. No, we're just going to stick with this. We're going to get rid of this guy. Level 20. Five chests. We don't have the potion barrier anymore, but uh, this definitely does have a lot more HP. So, um, what should we go with? I think the tumble bee can be cool. 100% chance to summon a bee when you roll. I think it is very awesome. So, I'm gonna. No, we're gonna. Actually, we have to focus on this guy right here. So, I'm just gonna do with that. And we're gonna take some uh, rampaging, I'd say. Rampaging or no, 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 the weakening. We wanted to go with the weakening. All right, this is, I think, a pretty nice loadout, guys, for the next episode. So, big thanks for watching. And yes, it took a pretty long time to complete this one, but boy, oh boy, these challenges, this punishment, and the fifth game rule, they are making things so difficult. But um, yes, it was a hell of a challenge. Please make next difficulty, I mean the next uh, game rule, a little bit easier, a little bit more uh, relaxing, let's say. So um, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed watching the video. And of course, if you are new to the channel, subscribe because there is so much more of this hardcore season coming your way, of course, and many other things for both Minecraft and Minecraft Dungeons. We have the Howling Peaks coming up very soon. And um, yeah, I am just super excited about the next episode. I don't know what to say right now, but um, I think it is time for me to make some noodles. So guys, see you next time. 4am out.